welcome to all of you now we discuss mathematical modeling question paper 2021 unit 1 paper dsc a 2.2 semester 6 bsc honors in mathematics university of calcutta Question number 2021 Unit 1 2a1 x square d2y dx square plus x dy dx plus bracket x square minus 4 square bracket close y equal to 0 near x equal to 0 actually uh, this solve this differential equation near x equal to 0 Uh, this is a Bessel functions equation of order 4 this is the 4 square due to 4 square this is order 4 so we can write this uh, y double dash plus y dash by x uh, plus bracket 1 minus 4 by x whole square bracket close y equal to 0 comparing with y double dash plus px y dash plus qx y equal to 0 px equals to 1 by x and qx x equal to 1 minus 4 by x square whole square clearly uh, x equal to 0 is a singular point this uh, in this denominator is x here also denominator x so x equal to 0 is a singular point and limit x tends to 0 x px is equal to 1 limit x tends to 0 x square qx uh, this is equal to minus 4 square is uh, both limit exist finitely hence x equal to 0 is a regular singular point then uh, we can see this solution find a C solution for this differential equation in the form uh, this uh, y equal to summation m equal to 0 to infinity cm x to the power actually this x minus 0 about 0 so x minus 0 whole to the power k minus k plus m with c0 not equal to 0 then y does equal to summation m equal to 0 to infinity bracket k plus m cm x to the power k plus m minus 1 and y double is equal to summation m equal to 0 to infinity uh, this factor k plus m into k plus m minus 1 cm x to the power k plus m minus 2 putting the above values of y y dash and y double dash in the equation 1 we get this uh, this x square summation um, bracket k plus m into bracket k plus m minus 1 cm x to the power k plus m minus 2 plus x summation k plus m bracket into cm x to the power k plus m minus 1 plus x square minus 4 square bracket into summation cm x to the power k plus m equal to 0 and then uh, this equal to uh, this x square so this x square and x to the power minus 2 so combining this this cm x to the power k plus m and this x and this x to the power minus 1 so we get x to the power k plus m here and plus and sum sum this x square and this x to the power k plus m so this we get x to the power k plus m plus 2 and for the last term this uh, 4 square into uh, summation cm x to the power k plus m and taking common cm x to the power k plus m we get this term k plus m k plus m minus 1 k plus m and minus 4 square this and this term k x to the power k plus m plus 2 for this term uh, we get this series this m equal to 0 to cm x to the power this equal to 0 and after simplification we get this k plus m plus 4 uh, into k plus m minus 4 and this cm x to the power k plus m and for this equal to 0 this equal to 0 sorry this equal to 0 
this equal to 0 and this is an identity and this uh, here the simplify this term k plus m k plus m minus 1 plus k plus m minus 4 square now we get this uh, two factors this into this this is an identity and this holds for all x equal to 0 and equating to 0 the coefficient of smallest power of x namely x to the power k we obtain the initial equation this c0 uh, put m equal to 0 here so this m equal to 0 m equal to 0 c0 x to the power k x to the power k here so for equating the smallest uh, powers of x that is x to the power k and so put here uh, this equals to 0 x to the power k so k equal to 4 and minus 4 since c0 not equal to 0 next equating to 0 the coefficient of x to the power k plus 1 in equation 5 we get this k plus 1 is put here first term m equal to 1 we get x to the power k plus 1 so k plus 5 into k plus k minus 3 uh, equal to 0 c in c1 into this so uh, we get c1 equal to 0 uh, because k equal to 4 and minus 4 so uh, these two factors are non-zero uh, so c1 equal to 0 next um, equating to 0 the coefficient of x to the power k plus m in 5 so k plus m that is from k plus m this is the uh, uh, coefficient this k plus m plus 4 k plus m minus 4 into cm uh, plus uh, this k plus m so put here uh, m equal to m minus 2 m minus 2 so we get k plus m so a c m minus 2 equal to 0 and m greater than equal to 2 then c m equal to minus c m minus 2 whole divided by k plus m plus 4 into k plus m minus 4 equation 6 putting m equal to 3 5 7 this uh, we get uh, c1 using the value c1 equal to 0 and this c1 equal to 0 we get c1 equal to c3 equal to c5 equal to c7 equal to 0 because uh, here c3 equal to c3 minus 2 that is c1 now c1 equal to 0 so c3 equal to 0 next putting m equal to 2 4 6 in 6 equals in 6 we get c2 equal to minus c0 by k plus 6 into k minus 2 and c4 equal to minus c2 by k plus 8 into k and c4 equal to uh, c2 value of c2 is this so minus c0 by k plus 6 k minus 2 so put here k minus 2 into k k by plus 6 into k plus 8 and c6 equal to this minus c4 by k plus 10 k plus 2 and, and value of c4 is this so put here value of c4 so c6 equal to <coughs> k minus 2 k k plus 2 k plus 6 c0 by this uh, k plus 8 and k plus 10 actually uh, we get for c6 we get uh, there are six, six factors in the denominator okay. 1 2 3 4 5 6 and this starts from k minus 2 k k plus 2 and this starts from k plus 6 k plus 8 k plus 10 and then c8 uh, total eight factors in the denominator and start from k minus 2 k minus 2 k k plus 2 k plus 4 and again starts from k plus 6 k plus 8 k plus 10 k plus 12 so and this uh, uh, when uh, c6 that is uh, 2 into 3 so this minus 1 to the power 3 that is equal to minus 1 and this 2 into 4 so minus 1 to the power 4 that is equal to plus so when c6 2 into 3 so here one minus one to the power three, so minus and C eight two into four, that is plus C four two into four, so minus one to the power two, and this putting these values of uh, this C six C eight C one C two C three into we get uh, this x to the power k sum of C m x to the power m, and that is x to the power k C zero plus C one x plus C two x square plus C three x, x, x cube. Now C one x C two C three x cube all 
uh, 0 so we get this c0 actually but k uh, 1 minus x square by k minus 2 k plus 6 plus x to the 4 by k minus 2 k k plus 6 k plus 8 minus x to the power 6 by this plus x to the power 8 by this and minus and so on this equation 8. Now k k value of k uh, either 4 or minus 4 if we take k equal to uh, minus 4 uh, then uh, this k equal to minus 4 put here so minus 4 plus 4 this is equal to 0. So uh, the coefficient uh, of this x to the power 8 and x to the power 10 and for x to the power 10 uh, minus x to the power 10 divided by k minus 2 k k k plus 2 k plus the whole square k plus 6 k plus 8 k plus 10 k plus 12 k plus 14 in the above series the coefficient are undefined because the term k plus 4 in the denominator so to get rid of this difficulty put uh, c0 equal to d0 into k plus 4 in 8 and get modified solution as this uh, multiply this c0 equal to d0 into k plus 4 so d0 x to the power k uh, this into k plus 4 minus x square into k plus 4 into this plus x to the power 4 into k plus 4 into this and x to the power 6 into k plus 4 by uh, these terms denominator same as plus x to the power 8 uh, into this k plus 4 but k plus 4 k plus 4 numerator and numerator cancel is that so x to the power 8 uh, by k minus 2 k k plus 2 k plus 6 k plus 8 k plus 10 and so uh, this uh, the differentiating uh, partially with respect to k uh, partially with respect to k uh, we get del y del k equal to d0 x, x to the power k log x and bracket a k plus 4 minus x square k plus 4 by k minus 2 k plus 6 and this and plus d0 xk this d0 differentiate of x to the power k with respect to k difference with respect to k into this term same as this and plus d0 x to the power k derivative of this so we get this So this uh, k plus 1 is uh, derivative is 0 and this term uh, twice x twice x uh, this with sorry yeah, this uh, with respect to k not twice x, x square into this denominator square denominator into numerator minus numerator minus uh, deno into denominator derivative of this and putting k equal to minus 4 and re uh, replacing d0 by a and from 9 we get a x to the power minus 4 into this equal to a u say this equation 11 and putting k equal to minus 4 and replacing d0 by b from 10 uh, we get del del k y at the point k equal to minus 4 uh, we get this plus this equal to b into b say equation 12 again putting k equal to 4 in equation 9 um, we get this actually this 13 expression 13 and 11 uh, are two linearly dependent solution so uh, this uh, 11 and 13 are linearly independent uh, dependent solution hence we consider two linearly independent solutions 11 and 12 thus uh, we get the required solution actually solution of the given differential equation is y equal to a u plus bv where a and b are arbitrary constants and u and b are given by uh, this expressing this uh, by 11 and by 12. Next question, question 2a2. Solve the initial value problem d2y dt square minus dy dt minus 2y equal to 18 e to the power minus t sine 3t y0 equal to 0 y dash 0 equal to 3 using Laplace transform method. Taking Laplace transform uh, on both sides of the given difference equation, we get this L of y double less minus L of y dash minus 2 L of y equal to 18 L of e to the power minus t sine 3 t, where L of y t equal to y bar s, say. 
So uh, L of y double dash, you can write a square L of y, L of y minus a is y zero minus y dash zero. And for this L y dash, this is equal to a is L y minus y zero, and L y this two into L y, and this is equal to three into eighteen by a plus one whole square plus three square. Because we know uh, L of e to the power b t sin a t equal to a by a minus b whole square plus a square by pi first shifting property so we can write this now uh, we write l of y equal to y bar this y bar is a function of s and y zero equal to zero this initial condition and y dash zero equal to three <coughs> put all this and after simplification we get y bar equal to this 3 into a square plus twice s plus 28 whole divided by a square plus twice s plus 10. So y bar equal to 3 into this by uh, denominator this into this factor equation 1. Now we write uh, this uh, as a partial fraction this a s plus b by uh, a square minus s minus 2 plus c s plus d by a square plus 2 s plus d. This a b uh, c d are constant uh, as we determine the values. Mm, by this and um, equating the coefficients of like power of s on both sides and uh, this uh, s cube so uh, in the left hand side no s cube so a plus c equal to 0 so c equal to minus a and this a square is twice a plus b minus c plus d is equal to 3 and uh, putting the value of c equal to minus a and this 84 equal to 10 d minus 20 d so d equal to 5b minus 42. So after simplification, uh, we get uh, a equal to minus 1 and b equal to 8, c equal to 1, d equal to minus 2. So y bar equal to minus s plus 8 whole divided by a square minus s minus 2 plus s minus 2 by a square plus twice s plus 10. Then y bar equal to, I can write this, s minus half whole square minus 3 by 2 whole square, 8 minus s plus s minus 2 s plus 1 whole square plus 3 square so we can write this 15 by 2 minus s minus half whole divided by s minus half whole square minus 3 by 2 whole square plus s plus 1 minus 3 by s plus 1 whole square plus 3 square so y t equal to l inverse of y bar so 15 by 2 into l inverse of 1 by uh, this minus L inverse of s minus half whole divided by s minus half whole square minus 3 by 2 whole square plus L inverse s plus 1 by s plus 1 whole square plus 3 square minus 3 into L inverse 1 by s plus 1 whole square plus 3 square. And now uh, by formula we can write this 15 by 2 e to the power t sine hyperbolic 3t by 2 whole divided by 3 by 2. Uh, actually we uh, use this formula here. Uh, this l inverse 1 by s minus the whole s minus b um, uh, whole square plus s square equal to u to the power bt sine at by u and this l inverse 1 by s minus b whole square minus s square equal to u to the power bt sine hyperbolic at by a and l inverse s minus b uh, whole divided by s minus b whole square plus s square equal to u to the power bt cos at and L inverse S minus B whole divided by S minus B whole square minus S square equal to E to the power BT cos hyperbolic AT. And we use this result and this we get this after simplification we get this. Now uh, we use hyperbolic sine hyperbolic equal to E to the power X minus E to the power minus X whole divided by 2 and cos hyperbolic X equal to E to the power X plus E to the power minus X whole divided by 2 and after simplification uh, we get the required solution is this Y equal to 2 e to the power 2t minus 3 e to the power minus t plus e to the power minus t bracket cos 3t minus sin 3t is the required solution. Question 2b1 uh, prove the recurrence formula for legendary polynomial this twice n plus 1 into this not into this x actually question is wrong uh, x pn x uh, equal to n plus 1 pn plus 1 x Mm, this so actually uh, this question
this question is wrong because incomplete question this uh, this term question 1a and this also uh, x not x this x into not into this x and this question is also wrong uh, b1 actually this question um, this x uh, c b uh, question paper 2022 dsc a 2.2 modeling mathematical modeling question 2b1 same question next question 3 at uh, 2 using generating function pnx prove the following p0 x equal to 1 p1 x equal to x p2 x equal to half 3 x square minus 1 p3 x equal to half bracket 5 x square minus 3 x and p4x equal to 1 by 8 bracket 35x to the power 4 minus 30x square plus 3. We know this 1 minus a 2xz plus z square whole to the power minus half is a generating function for the region record by pnx. And so uh, this 1 minus twice xz plus z square whole to the power minus half equal to summation and equal to 0 to infinity z to the power in pnx and mod x is less than um, equal to 1 and mod of z is less than 1 is equal to p0x into plus z into p1x plus z square p2x plus z to p3x plus up to infinity so we can write this uh, 1 minus z uh, bracket 2x minus z whole to the power minus up uh, binomial expansion and this minus up so we can uh, infinite series uh, this z into twice x minus z this modulus value of this must be less than 1 uh, this 1 uh, plus mm, in uh, in is this n into x plus 1 into 3 by 2 into 4 into uh, n square plus 1 into 3 into 5 2 into 4 into 6 into n cube and so on so uh, this gives in half twice xz this twice xz minus half uh, minus half into z square this z into z and this 1 into 3 2 into 4 uh, expanding this uh, into 4 x square z square minus 4 x z cube plus z to the power 4 and next from this 1 into 3 into 5 by 2 into 4 into 6 uh, this expanding uh, this 2 x minus z whole cube we get this 8x cube z cube minus 12x square z to the power 4 plus 6x z to the power 5 minus z to the power 6 plus and from uh, this term and this z to the power 4 2x minus z whole to the power 4 uh, we only the first term um, right here 16x to the power 4 into z to the power 4 plus dot 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 plus up to infinity equating the coefficients of the like parts of a z uh, from uh, both sides 1 and 2 uh, this uh, 1 this 1 is this and this 2 so this p0 x actually p0 x means the uh, constant um, coefficient and uh, this no z here so uh, coefficient of z to the power 0 so this is 1 only so this p0 x equal to 1 and p1 x is actually the coefficient of z this coefficient of z so uh, this coefficient of z is here coefficient of z is half into 2x that is equal to x and p2x is the coefficient of z square so coefficient of z square is minus half and this coefficient of z square is this 1 into 3 by 2 into 4 into 4x square and this so we get coefficient of z is equal to this and p3 is the coefficient of z cube and z cube is this uh, 1 into 3 into 2 into 4 minus 4x uh, plus 1 into 3 into 5 by 2 into 4 into 6 and to 8x cube and this z cube is this so uh, after simplification we get this p4x is the coefficient of z to the power 4 and z to the power 4 z to the power 4 is this 1 into 3 by 2 into 4 this z to the power 4 plus and z to the power 4 is here so minus 12x square and z to the power 4 from this term so we write all these term uh, plus simplification we get 1 by 8 bracket 35 to the power x to the power 4 minus 32 x square plus 3. Next question 2 c1 
so that a log e to the power minus 2t bracket 3 cos 60 minus 5 sin 60 equal to 3 bracket p minus 8 whole divided by p square plus 4p plus 40. Now a log Laplace transform of cos 60 equal to p by p square plus 6, 6 square and Laplace transform of sin 60 is equal to 6 by p square plus 6 square. So uh, using linearity property uh, we get this a log Laplace transform of 3 cos 60 minus 5 sin 60 equal to 3 into a log cos 60 minus 5 into a log sin 60 and this is equal to 3p minus 30 whole divided by p square plus 36. So a log e to the power minus 2t equal to this, uh, this is using the first shifting property because of minus 2. So we write here is p plus 2, 3 into p plus 2 and p plus 2 whole square plus 36. And after simplifying, uh, we get this 3 into bracket p minus 8 whole divided by p square plus 40 plus 40. Next question for 2c2, evaluate a inverse of 2s plus 1 whole divided by s plus 1 whole square into s plus 2 whole square. Now first we write uh, this equal to uh, 2s by 2s plus 1 whole divided by x s square plus minus twice s plus 1 s square plus 4s plus 4. Uh, this equal to uh, simply pen into partial facts on this a s plus b whole divided by this plus c s plus d and the whole divided by this and a b c d are constants uh, as to determine from this relation. And this identity we get uh, equating the like powers of s from both sides we get a plus c equal to 0 uh, 4b plus d equal to 1 and 4a plus b minus twice c plus d equal to 0 and 4a plus 4b plus c minus 2d equal to 2 and this uh, plus simplifying we get a equal to 0 b equal to 1 by 3 c equal to 0 d equal to minus 1 by 3 and then equation 1 becomes uh, this 1 by 3 common 1 by s minus 1 whole square minus 1 by s plus 2 whole square 1 by s minus 1 whole square actually this is the s minus 1 whole square this is s minus 2 so s plus 2 whole square so uh, we get uh, using linearity property 1 by 3 inverse of this minus 1 by 3 inverse of this so by first using first shifting property we get this and this equal to ultimately we get t by 3 bracket e to the power t minus e to the power minus 2t here we use this l inverse f of small f s minus a equal to e to the power a t capital f t first shifting for inverse level transform l inverse 1 by s square equal to t and the linearity property is this next question Question 2d1. If j and x is a basic function of first kind, then show that x j n dash x equal to n j n x minus x j n plus 1 x and hence deduce that d dx of <coughs> bracket <coughs> x to the power minus n j n x equal to minus x to the power minus n j n plus 1 x. Now the definition of j n x we get uh, this uh, d dx of x to the power minus n j n x equal to d dx of x to the power minus n. This value of j n x is this summation r equal to 0 to infinity minus 1 to the power r 1 by r factorial gamma n plus 1 n plus r plus 1 into x by 2 whole to the power twice r plus n. So, uh, differentiate with respect to x uh, actually we get x to the power minus n. So, x to the power minus n I cancel. So, x, to the, x by 2 whole to the power twice r this 1 by 2 to the power r. Uh, plus n is here, so d dx of x to the power twice r. This summation uh, we get twice r into x to the power twice r minus 1, and this I cancel this 2 uh, 2 to the power this 2, so 2 to the power r plus n minus 1, and gamma n plus r plus 1, and this r into r minus 1, so cancel r and r, so we get this. Now uh, this r minus 1 factorial is infinity when r equal to 0 so the summation starts from r equal to 1 to infinity now by uh, changing r uh, by replacing r by m plus 1 then when r equal to uh, 1 m equal to 0 when r equal to 1 r equal to 1 uh, m equal to 0 r equal to 1 m equal to 0 and so we get this and this is the 
minus h cube minus in sum is on this gamma n plus 1 plus r plus 1 and this n plus 1 plus twice r changing the dummy index is m and by r and this minus x cube minus n g n plus 1 into x by the definition of g n plus 1 x so uh, we get this um, so minus n and derivative of this x to the power minus n minus 1 g n x plus x to the power minus n g n dash x equal to minus x to the power minus n g n plus 1 x dividing both sides by x to the power minus n and we get uh, this the required result uh, this now second part of this question this ddx of this equal to this actually you can write ddx of x to the power n minus n g n x equal to uh, this uh, difference with this into this plus x to the power minus n into g n dash x common x to the power minus n uh, minus 1 bracket this uh, the value of g n dash x, x g n dash x equal to by 2 n g n x minus x g n plus 1 x cancel this term and this term so we get minus x to the power minus n g n plus 1 x is the proof next question 2d 2 using Roderick's formula prove that pn plus 1 dash x minus pn minus 1 dash x equal to twice n plus 1 bracket into pn x where pn x is the legendary polynomial of the first kind of degree n now the Roderick's formula is given by pn x equal to 1 by 2 to the power n factorial and dn dx to the power n bracket x square minus 1 whole to the power n and substituting n by n plus 1 in 1 equation 1 we get pn plus 1 x 1 by 2 to the power n plus 1 n plus 1 factorial dn plus 1 by dx to the power n plus 1 bracket x square minus 1 whole to the power n plus 1 so uh, this dn dx to the power n so this ddx of this so after simplifying ddx of this so we get n plus 1 x, x square minus 1 whole to the power n twice x so after simplifying uh, this 1 by 2 to the power n in factorial d n dx n bracket x into x square minus 1 whole to the power n then p n plus 1 dash x is equal to uh, d dx of this 1 by 2 to the power n factorial d n dx to the power n into bracket x uh, dx x x square minus 1 whole to the power n so after simplifying um, we get this uh, combining this we get this term and come this to this so this equal to actually this twice n plus 1 pnx plus ddx of uh, this 1 by 2 to the power n plus n minus 1 n minus 1 factorial dn minus 1 by dx to the power n minus 1 bracket x square minus 1 whole to the power n minus 1 and replacing n by n minus 1 we get 2n plus 1 pnx plus ddx of pn minus 1x actually this is the pn minus 1x so we get pn plus 1 pnx plus pn minus 1x dx hence the result thank you for watching